Global Hotel Management System. Uh, we are showing you the reservation section for now. After you click on the hotel management icon, the software opens into login window where you can log in your credentials with you, your user privileges and you can get into the system. Once you are logged into the system, you can choose from different options to log in into and uh, get into the window of that particular section. But now we'll show you the re recording of the front desk system and how you can access into and how you can work with front desk office of Crosso Hotel Management. Uh, reservation basic info what you can see in this in window is the reservation section where you can put reservation name property book a code company bling information and all of the features that you are seeing on the screen booker code is the code of an agent and property means the hotel property that you will that the customer will be staying in and you can also have special instructions for that particular reservation in that basic information Uh, you can see the reservation code automatically generating over there so that you can uh, track that reservation with a specific code after the names and all the stuffs you have to put on the name of the reservation contact so that you can contact him in the future or maybe you can have that information so that you could use it in future uh, future days reservation You need to put on all of these information because all of these informations are vital uh, for the system to store in its database. And it's kind of good as well so that, I mean, if you have to find out the information later, you can get it all done by this basic reservation info. After the reservation basic information we go to business source information source is the part where you put on the information about where that business or where that client is coming in from maybe that could be coming up from an NGO or NGO from Europe and the source company would be a travel agent and the payment mode would be cash that he has preferred and the mode of reservation shows the what kind of reservation oh sorry what kind of mode did he use to reserve the rooms after the business source we go to room details room details help you to select the meal plans rate type and uh, rooms it also helps you to input the name of the guest, uh, either they are adults or children, or how many uh, infants are there, and the meal plans. It will also show you the room availability from a certain date to a certain date at the right section of the window. And you can also select the bath type, which could be inclusive or exclusive in that particular rate that you have put on for that certain room. After we have put in the room details, we go to the confirmation section. In this section, we set the confirmation date and we also set up the user who has confirmed the booking our confirmation remarks if, if it is provided by the guest and after confirmation we move on to reconfirmation and in reconfirmation we verify the details each uh, engine and details and uh, we also put on expected deposit and expected date of arrival of that confirmed guest as you can see in this screen there is a pickup drop entry and in which you can put on the pickup date when 
and the time of that particular uh, guest who will be booked to your hotel. And you can also have the settings where it's complimentary or you're charging it or he will be sharing it or it's just a personal ride that you're getting from your hotel as a You can also put on the vehicle model and uh, the details and save the information so that you would get alerted on the date and time of his <coughs> arrival. If the arrivals are in group, you can use the following instructions or you can follow the following steps to add their names and other informations like address contact information and uh, email addresses using the following window that you are seeing on the screen. This setting is useful for those guests who are coming in group so that we can have the information of every individual in the group and e even if we want to assign a separate room for each and every individual we can assign it by their names and uh, by the preferences. After you have saved the information, you can assign the rooms that uh, particular guest and you can also select if the guest is an individual or it's, he is coming in with a group. You can assign them the rooms by using the following steps that you can see on the demo and uh, once you have assigned them, you can check in the information from the following window and after you have totally verified then you can move on to check in section so that you can check in the person or check in your guest in the reset and uh, you can deliver your services in the hotel itself you can also select the posting of the ledgers on the particular counting section or accounting heads by using the following information that you can see on the screen.